What is going on guys? Thank you so much for jumping into this video today. My name is Danny Coldblood, aka my music videos, and I'm here to give you guys a review of the movie Deadpool 2. If you guys liked Deadpool 1, you'll like Deadpool 2. Since this is a spoiler free video, there's really nothing else I can say without spoiling the movie, obviously. So thank you guys for watching, and stay tuned for more awesome content. Until next time guys, take it easy. Alright, I guess I'm not that much of a jerk. I'll give you guys a little bit of an idea of how it was. I was just pulling your donkey dick a little bit. Anyway, Deadpool 2 was really, really good in my opinion. Since I am doing a spoiler-free video, I don't want to give anything away. Most of the time when I see movies, like, the trailers usually give so much away that you kind of know what you're in for. Which really sucks because most of the time the trailers give away some of the key points within the plot and you basically know what's going to happen in the movie. With Deadpool 2, I was surprised with a lot of the things I've seen because the trailers really didn't give too much away, so it's really a good movie. Hopefully nobody spoils anything for you because if you're a fan of Marvel and you're a fan of Deadpool, you're really going to enjoy the sequel. Usually when I go see a movie and it's a sequel, I always ask myself the question, was it better than the first one or how was it in comparison to the first one? And this movie is very different when looking at it in that kind of way. Deadpool 2, in my opinion, can't really be compared to Deadpool 1 in the sense of is it better or worse. I would have to say I like it just as much as the first one, and after seeing it more times, maybe I'll feel differently. Maybe I'll like it even more, or who knows, maybe I'll like it even less. It is a true Deadpool movie. It's got everything that you would expect, breaking the fourth wall, the comedy, the jokes, it seems like there's a lot of, uh, basically, jokes and puns, parodies, and references, slash easter eggs to, like, the Marvel Universe, and, uh, I guess even a little bit of other things. I don't want to ruin anything, obviously, but you kind of have to know your history a little bit. You have to kind of know some of your Marvel movies, because they do dig deeper, I guess, um, this time around with their puns and their parodies, okay? Their, their references kind of are easy to miss if you don't know your, your shit, basically. If you don't know your Marvel and other stuff. I don't want to ruin stuff for you guys, so I'm kind of being very general, but it was a great movie. They, you know, do the sequel right. You don't have to sit there for five minutes or ten minutes at the beginning of the movie and see the whole history of why his face is burned and why he has these powers. And They don't do that. When you watch it, it's obvious that it starts after the first movie ends. And it does it in a way where if you didn't see the first one, you're going to be confused on who Deadpool is and how he is and why he is and where he came from, okay? So I like that they don't sit there and give you a huge explanation of the whole beginning and intro, you know? Every single Batman movie they do that. Every single movie, they always have to explain how they came to be. Well, if you want to know that stuff, watch the first movie. This is a sequel and they did it right. In my opinion, I think this was a great movie, a great sequel, and it was totally Deadpool in every way, shape, and form. So if you guys liked the first one, like I said at the very beginning, I seriously think you would like the second one. I'm interested to see what you guys think. If you guys seen the movie and you want to let me know your thoughts and everything, definitely leave that information in the comments below. If you haven't seen the movie, I would refrain from looking at the comments because most of the time people put stuff in there that will spoil it for you and I don't want you to go into a spoiler-free video and then checking the comments out and finding out, oh my god, this happens? Really? So that basically wraps it up, guys. I'm going to end out the video because I really don't want to spoil anything and, you know, any detail could spoil a movie for people. You don't know what part of a movie might make somebody's day. So all I'm going to say is it's worth it. Definitely go see it. If you liked the first one, you'll like the second one. It was done right, in my opinion. As always, guys, if you enjoyed the video, let me know by hitting the thumbs up button down below. And if you guys did not enjoy the video, well, then let me know by hitting the dislike button. But would you be so courteous and kind to let me know why in the comments below so I can go ahead and improve the videos and broadcasts for future viewers. Thank you guys so much for joining. I appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video or broadcast. Thank you, take it easy, ta-ta, and as always, peace. Thank <laughs> you.